Local channels have been one of the things keeping people in overpriced cable contracts. Thankfully, the Tableau OTA DVR can help you watch and record content on your local channels without cable. Tableau has come out with a new fourth generation model that corrects the fee-based structure we didn't like in older models. We typically buy all the products and services we test, but in this case, the company sent us a new model to review. It's not a sponsored video, so you can rest assured the opinions are entirely our own. In this review, we'll cover how to set up and use a new fourth generation Tableau device. We'll also show you what the new Tableau app looks like and what it's like to find, watch, and record content from your local networks through it. Stick around to the end where we'll give you our take on whether or not it's worth buying. Let's dive into the price and features of the new device. Tableau currently offers two device packages, the device itself, which retails for $99.95 at time of recording, and the Tableau Total System, which includes an antenna with a range of 35 miles and retails for $109.95 again at time of recording. The device itself is a step up from previous dual and quad models. It's slimmer, lighter, and more robust. It includes 128 gigabytes of onboard storage, a USB port for up to eight terabytes of expandable storage, an ethernet port, coaxial port for your TV antenna cable, power adapter, and two ATSC 1.0 TV tuners. The included storage allows you to record about 50 hours of high definition content, and Tableau supports USB 2.0 and 3.0 portable hard drives between one and eight terabytes in size. When you connect the antenna to the device and set it up in the app, you can use the Tableau app to stream live and recorded content from your local channels to all the TV screens in your home that are connected to the same wireless or wired network as the Tableau. The new app does not support out-of-home viewing. That's disappointing and something we hope Tableau will correct with future updates. Tableau has also added more than 40 fast channels into the app, putting them alongside your locals in the channel guide within the Tableau app. Importantly, there are no fees and no subscriptions required to access TV Guide data and advanced recording features in the app. This means that you will be able to see program guide data for 14 days, record series with one button, extend recording time on sports and other live events manually or automatically, automatically avoid duplicate recordings, and more, all free. With all that covered, let's look at how to set up the Tableau device. First, download the Tableau app. This is the first OTA DVR release since Scripps took over Tableau and it shows with a completely redeveloped experience. The new Tableau app is available on Roku, Amazon Fire TV, Android and iOS and Google TV, as well as through most smart TVs. Apple TV, Samsung and Vizio are all going to be added within the next few months. As an aside, Tableau says it is working to make previous generations of Tableau devices compatible with the new Tableau app as well. The app will help you as well with steps on how to position your antenna, connect your Tableau to the internet, and scan for your local channels. If you need an antenna, we recommend a Mohu model. Next, connect the power adapter to your Tableau and connect Tableau to the internet through the ethernet cable or via your Wi-Fi network. If you want more storage than what's included, connect your external hard drive now. When the channel scan and setup is complete, you can begin watching and recording through the Tableau app. For us, setup was clunky and time consuming. We had to install a firmware update, which is not uncommon. All the steps took about 15 minutes, which is not bad. But then the app froze on us. It seemed like the app on our Android phone and the app on the TV weren't communicating with each other. We uninstalled the app on both devices multiple times and still could not get content to load, which was frustrating. An hour later, we installed the Tableau app on an iPad, ran through the setup process again, and voila! everything loaded just fine. Now, this may be a known issue with Android devices, as others in the Google Play Store referenced having similar issues to the ones we experienced. Tableau does offer customer support via chat and phone, so if you encounter issues and you don't have an Apple device, contact them. Now, let's look at what it's like to use the Tableau app to watch local and scripts fast channels. The home screen features a bar across the top that displays what's on the last channel you were watching. Beneath that is a search field the library where your recordings are stored, the home tab, the live channel guide, and then options to filter content by categories like TV shows, movies, and sports. There's also a settings icon on the top right where you can access global account settings. Tableau will display featured content from channels you favorited right up front on the home screen with a way to watch that show live or view more episodes of it. 
It will also populate with episodes from upcoming shows on your local networks and fast channels within the app, so you can schedule to record them easily. Like other streaming apps, you'll see rows of content organized by genre and by channel. And Tableau has provided program information and cover art that you can use to learn more about the cast and other features for various shows. It has also recommended content based on things you've favorited and recorded that should get smarter over time about helping you discover content you enjoy. Overall, it's easy to use and it's just fine given that it's free. There are some downsides. For instance, if you filter sports content, you can't filter by team, only by sport. So you can't filter to record all Cowboys games, for instance, like you can in paid streaming apps like Fubo and YouTube TV. However, the grid-like cable guide makes it easy to see what's on now and what's coming up over the next 14 days on your local networks. You can select to view or record a show right from the guide. Arrowing down will bring up a row of additional channels, more episodes of the show you're watching, the option to see what is airing next, and more information about the show. You can also pause live TV and turn captions on or off. Clicking on anything in the future will bring up recording options as well. You can record a single episode, learn more about the series, schedule a series recording, or add the channel the show airs on to your favorites list. Once you click to record an episode, additional recording options will appear. Let's look at those now. You can now enjoy advanced recording features free with any Tableau device. You can customize your schedules by adding recording time, setting limits on how many recordings to keep, what channel to record a show from, set limits on how many recordings in a series to keep, and more. You can choose to record an episode or an entire series, and you can smart schedule to avoid recording reruns. You can even add extra time to the end of live events so you don't miss the ending. Once a recording is complete, you can fast forward through it using thumbnails to skip to just the parts you want to see. You can also use time shift to start watching in progress recordings as well as 30 seconds after the recording begins. And of course, you can pause and rewind recordings as well. Tableau also includes closed captioning and 5.1 surround sound support. Now getting back to the guide, you can use the channels feature in the top left of the guide to jump to any channel or to change the day in the guide, or to filter the guide by favorite channels or recent channels. And remember, you can view up to 14 days of data in the guide. You can also go to the top of the guide where the date is displayed and use the right arrow selector on your remote to jump by 12 hour increments. All right, let's wrap up with our take. Is the new Tableau 4th Gen OTA DVR worth buying? The Tableau 4th Gen device is pricier than Air TV models, which is another leading OTA DVR brand, but does include storage, so on price, it shakes out fairly evenly. The channel guide is nice, as are the included features to browse content by genre and channel. The included fast channels from scripts are also nice, and all of the advanced recording options are great too. However, not being able to view recordings out of the home is a real detractor. We'd also like to see Tableau work to get its interface incorporated as a live TV source with Fire TV sticks, so locals could be integrated into that functionality. That's something Air TV devices offer through the Sling app, which integrates with the Fire TV Live Guide. If you are in the market for a new OTA DVR and you don't travel frequently, we do recommend buying a Tableau fourth generation model because of the advanced recording features, included storage, slim design, and the overall ease of use of the app. However, if you do travel frequently and you want to be able to view your recordings away from your home, try an Air TV model instead. Making smart decisions with the streaming devices you purchase is becoming more important as prices rise across the streaming space. We'll keep helping you do that in our videos and in our live streams, which air on Fridays at noon central. Do you use an OTA DVR to record shows on your local networks? Let us know in the comments below. And if you haven't already, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you can get all our latest news and reviews when they drop. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in our next video.